Hi and welcome to reviews, fixes and hacks and as you can see here's the Hydra EHN99 and what I've got is your EHN which is your ethyl hexyl nitrate and this is a cetane improver. Now according to this it should boost the cetane rating from anywhere between 4 to 8 points and if you have a look at it there it is ethyl hexyl nitrate now the dosage for this um, what it says is usual dosage at 1 to 1000 to 1 to 500 and it's got a maximum of 1 to 333 now what i will do is i will go for 1 to 500 okay now it says depending on the quality of the fuel. Now to make this a sort of fair test, what I've done is I've filled up the vehicle, my test vehicle, which is the Astra um, 1.7 CDTI. It's a 2004 model and it is a vehicle that I'm using to test all of these products. This is the first of all the tests I will be doing. So if I've got 20 litres of fuel, 20 litres, then what I will need is 40 mils, 40 mils to give it a ratio of 1 to 500, 20 mils, 20 litres of fuel, so 20 millilitres of the EHN will give me a 1 to 1000 um, ratio, whereas what I need is 40 mils to give me 1 to 500 ratio. Now, if you don't understand it, that one is your 1 litre. This 1,000 is in millilitres. So to obviously get the ratio, what I've done is I've said for one litre of fuel, 500. So there it is, one millilitre treats one litre or 0.5 mils. Well, what I need is one millilitre to treat 0.5 litres which is equivalent to one litre and two milliliters, so I need 40. Okay, let's go do it. So, to do the dosage, I don't know if you can see this on the camera, but I'm gonna go to a slightly dimmer place. I've got the vehicle in front of me, but on there, what you can see is the markings. So there's the milliliters. Like I said, I need 40, so I'll be filling it up to the reservoir up to 20. Now to fill it, all you do is undo this one. So you've got undo this. It's coming off. Yes, it is. Oh, it's well sealed. Right. Well, very well sealed in fact. I have to poke it through with I think this is a very good thing the fact that it is sealed as well as it is now to give you an idea it actually smells very strong very chemically um, it's got that sort of red X sort of smell but red X you can clearly smell the um, ever seen in it this one um, at the moment what I've got is 25 mils so 25 I will need to do another 15 and that should give me the 40 mils in total Here's the connector, so to make ease of putting, I've connected this connector that comes with the actual um, packaging. And like I say, I've got it to 25 mils. Now it's time to dose it. Once I've dosed it, I'll get back to you and give you an update on any um, effects that are noticeable to myself as just a consumer. Now, just to let you know, in the vehicle, um, it's a 1.7 CDTI, as I mentioned. What I've got is just supermarket diesel, the regular fuel. 
and the idea is I'm going to put it to the medium sort of concentration they've said so it's one mil per half a litre and see if there's any noticeable difference okay um, just finishing off the test now um, with the EHN 99% pure um, obviously the 40 mils that I put in is double dosage um, and now I'm driving the vehicle but well, what do I notice what I can tell you is um, like I say I'm using this as a this is the test vehicle basically this is um, a lot of the videos I do is mainly what I've done on this vehicle um, now with the EHCN the ethyl hexyl nitrate what I can tell you is it's noticeably quieter there's a subtle quietness about it um, there is definitely um, an improvement in the smoothness of the engine is there any increase in power or anything like that no not at all not that I can um, noticeably tell anyway um, but what I can clearly say is that yes definitely the engine is quieter um, the other thing I can mention is that in terms of the power delivery it just seems a bit smoother it picks up speed slightly better not to say that it's faster not that I can accelerate from 0 to 60 in five seconds or anything quicker but it's definitely um, smoother in terms of the power delivery um, I feel as though as I'm picking up speed it just is a slight there's a slight smoothness about it um, but apart from that um, there's definitely not much else to it but like I say it is early days uh, I have only had it in since well just over 24 hours now and I've driven approximately 60 odd miles with it now predominantly the mileage is being town driving urban um, haven't been on the motorway or anything like that but so far uh, within a matter of 10 miles of driving I could tell there was a difference within um, the smoothness the quietness the power delivery but definitely can I say that it's made some sort of difference yes it has so yeah I mean on to the next one now so I'll wait till the fuel on this runs totally dry um, or very extremely low before I try the next um, Hydra sample which is the dpb i believe it is dpb yeah so i'll try that and see whether that gives anything or any other noticeable improvement but anyway keep an eye out please again like and subscribe hopefully i can get to the thousand 1k subscribers mark and if there are any videos just let me know